mate. Can you open the door, please? Look, I just need to use the phone for two seconds. Can you just open the door? Mate, are you serious? Look at me. Um, look, I'm sorry it's late, babe, but um, can I come stay around yours? I wouldn't ask, but he's completely off his face. Please, babe. So, what happened to your face? Did I hear you say it was a guy? My ex. Really? Did you do something wrong? <laughs> no. I just stupidly thought I might be able to go out and enjoy myself. I bet you treat your girls dead nice, don't you? No, there is no girl. Really? I struggle talking to girls. Yeah, you're talking to me, all right? I'm Terry. <laughs> See, that wasn't that hard, was it? Dan, don't move. She's got a syringe to you now. Put the syringe down, yeah? I'm sick of my minute. No, I'm done. I just want to go, you know, all right? What's your name, sweetheart? Josie. All right, Josie, listen to me. You're not in any trouble yet, but if you touch him with that needle, you will be. It's decision time, Josie. All right. I went cold turkey for three weeks once, and it was like the worst pain that you could imagine. Do you know what happened when I went back on the rock? I overdosed. Well, if you were serious, you'd go on a programme. Well, to be honest, that's why I'm here. What? Well, I heard that if you get nicked enough times that you get put on one of them DTTOs. No, that's not how it works. You need to see a drug referral worker. If you're serious, I can take you to one now. Thanks. Come on. I'm always defending you. I look fucking stupid. Why? People ask me, oh, how's you and Jay? Oh, yeah, we're fine, thanks. Really fucking tight. Oh, don't, don't make me, don't make like this is my fault. It is everyone's fault for hours, but you can't see that. I don't know. I don't know anymore, Ash. Oh, what does that mean? I, I just, I can't stand Josh. Either way, he's causing us problems. It is not Josh's fault. He is not the problem. You're letting everyone break us up. Talk to me. What is on your mind? I need space. Are you serious? Where's your mother? She died. Cancer last year. That must have been hard. Yeah. So I got stuck with me dad. You find it difficult to get on with your dad? You don't know nothing about me. Anything about me? Yeah. But my mum, well, she were a laugh. We were more like best mates or sisters. We used to go out clubs and stuff together. All the men fancied her, even though she was getting a bit old. Not as old as you, though, but, like, you know, she still had it. So you used to go out to clubs with your mother? Yeah. It were a laugh, that's all. Oh, I bet it was. I bet you weren't such good mates with your mum. Thank goodness, no. Parents shouldn't be mates. They should set an example. An example like what? So I can be more like you? Oh, no, perhaps not like me. Because I don't want to be anything like you. Well, heaven forbid I should have a daughter like you. Looks like we were dead right about each other, doesn't it? That nurse reckons I need to rehydrate. She's probably right. Doesn't half days boring. Well, that means it's doing you good times this to drink up. Oh, you're checking up on me now, are you? No, I'm checking up on Cal. She's breaking the news to Frank now. You're not leaving just because of that kissing thing, are you? Yeah, ate all my food too and played your music and ignored me and constantly rubbed it in that I couldn't drink. You can drink, you know, Carl. You know, Carl, I didn't mean to rub it in. I think it's good that you don't get hammered all the time. I just get nervous and then need a few to make me feel better. Then I go mess things up and break boys' hearts. You didn't break my heart. Ah, so why are you leaving then? Please, no more drinking today. That's all right. There's some awesome fruit smoothies in one of the fridges upstairs. Much tastier than water. Do you fancy one? Wow, this is brilliant. Uh, cocktails, you name it, I'll mix it. Ooh, I'll have a between the sheets then, please. Can I just have a Diet Coke? A Diet Coke? Come on, Mika. Uh, make your wheat one if you like. Hey, we should be speaking French, shouldn't we? OK. Well, I would just say between the sheets and French, Brett. Entre les draps. Entre les draps. 
Hey, <laughs> rat. Da 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 da. <laughs> now you. Come on. I'm up for that. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are we resting? Yeah, well, it's not funny. I <laughs> to wet your knickers. You can tell your mother she'll be receiving a letter from me. It would be different if my mum were a teacher, wouldn't it? Or at least copping off for one. Hey! You keep your crap school. Cheeky get. I've never felt like this before, Jamie. Even when I found out, I just made ridiculous excuses for you. I know. I know. No, you don't know. How could you know? I can't imagine that. I don't know what to say. What do you want me to say? Why the fuck should I tell you what to say? Even now you can't say the right things. 